we talk about English. We talk about simple barreras. It's really important that you take into consideration. This is for cross and race. I'm going to do it in a minute longer for you to see the energies. Observe how I take the woman to a close, that my leg is behind me. This is to preserve my space and my access, her space and her access. The key is synchronization and frame. The synchronization of stepping at the same time. But here I'm going to go down to generate my projection. My projection is the barrita. And now hers. And now I'm going to send it into a side and the hero. I catch her back cross. As you can see in the hero, I catch her back cross. Now, all right? This one, we did a difference, is catching now the side step. Catching the side step, we do the same movement. My leg is behind, so I need to pass under my axis. The barrita, it depends how much I bend my knee. Do shorter barritas and any longer. And now I'm going to catch and generate this reverse sacada. And in the old days, it was called serpentinas. This reverse sacada is very organic, very easy. There is no necessary to use this procedure to arrive to the side step. You could go to the side step in an ocho portado, because an ocho portado is nothing other than side step, front cross, side step, front cross. A hero is composed of these three steps. Side, back, side, friend, friend, side, back, side, friend. So every time I organize those movements, friend, side, friend, side, taco is full of these small elements. Other way to do that is taking her two ochos. With my frame now, I'm going to be capable to do a saludo or ask her to cross. See, now I'm taking her into a back cross, and my lead, it would be a side step. But because it's a code of communication that I am tired of saying, that is when the man is touching constantly, many things. So the idea is to communicate with him. I am here, and she said, I am here too. What's new? Now is the era of contact, right? And we talk about that. And it's broken the contact when I broke the contact. You ladies don't, broke it, don't break the contact. So we decided to use the tomada in the back row. And we could ask her to go to the axis. Now, side is there, and here we are again. Here we can take the idea of doing this hero, or you can take the idea of doing this interesting, strange sacada. It's interesting to remark here, if you notice, the nature of the brace have one side closed and one side open. Every single movement here is done in the close side. So this is possible to do it in a very, very close space. Close and raise, I mean. And not open it whatsoever. As you can see, the closer, the better. The key for this reverse sacada is just to rotate the hip behind you, bend the knee to extend the leg, grab, and go. Take in consideration that the feet of the woman have to be in the back cross in the back cross. I get in, back cross for the woman, then I can step and pull it. So thank you very much, class over. <laughs>